Style, you're going to start at the very back. Part a small to medium sized section and pin the rest of it away. Then you're going to take your spritz bottle and spritz your hair concentrating on the roots. Don't spray the entire section because your hair will shrink. After you've done that, apply a gel of your choice. Right now I'm using Eco Styler Gel but I also use a few others. Ooh. And I'll talk about that in a second. But apply whatever gel you want to the roots of your hair mostly. You can take it down the hair shaft a little bit, but don't apply the gel throughout the entire section because your hair is going to shrink. And you don't want that. Apply it on the roots, apply it to the back because you want to make sure that it's smoothed down as much as possible. And then brush it down until you have your desired smoothness. And put that section in its own ponytail. Okay, so first of all, I'm using Eco Styler Gel. And then I'm using Marie's Edge Wax. And as you can see, I put it throughout my whole head, not just my edges, because if it can lay your edges, it can lay the rest of your hair the way you need it to. So that's what we're doing. I really wish I had some beeswax, but I don't. But instead of that, I am using Got To Be Glued Styling Gel and a little bit of water, not too much. I'm just using it to kind of rejuvenate my hair but you don't want to cause your hair to shrink because if it shrinks it's going to be harder to put into a bun so you only want to apply a little bit of water and mostly gel okay so the rest of this process is pretty easy you're just going to repeat the steps so separate another section clip the rest away apply a little bit of water if you need to then apply the gel of your choice brush it down and then use another hair tie to add that section to the previous section once you get to the top you can go ahead and make your part just so that it's there and you don't have to worry about it anymore do a side part a middle part no part whatever you prefer i like to do the side part but that's just me and just keep going until you get to the top your arms are probably burning you're getting hungry I don't know we're almost done sort of the top is by far the hardest part because I don't know about you but the top center part of my head is like my thickest hair so once I get up here it just takes a lot more effort to keep it all down because it's so thick. I'm basically going to do the same thing I've been doing. Wet it a little, apply the gel, brush it down, put a hair tie on it, and we're just gonna do that up until I'm finished. When I get to the top sections of my hair, I do apply gel to the whole entire section, including the ends, because I want my bun to be super duper flat. This wasn't that important for the hair in the back, but if there isn't enough gel to hold your hair down at the top, your bun is going to be lumpy. If you have thick 4C hair like mine, prepare to use a lot of gel because this style cannot be achieved without it. Oh, and your biceps will burn. I am finally at the last portion of my head and I want to thank my Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. I want to thank my mom and dad for having me. All the little people who contributed to me in any way, shape, or form. It's truly, it's truly an honor. So we're going to do the same thing. We're going to do the same thing. Apply some water, apply some gel, edge control, brush it down. And we're also going to use another hair tie because we just need one last one to complete. We're near the end. Finally. I know. It's been a long road. I just got done applying gel to the last 
and final layer of my hair. And I added more edge control to my edges. And pretty much all over, I might even frame. The final step. Take as much extra hair as you want, more hair for a bigger bun and less hair for a smaller one, and attach it to your little ponytail with a hair tie. I like to take a little bit to cover my hair so it doesn't show through before I wrap it around to form the bun. My bun never looks the same twice. <laughs> Sitting on the juice, she's so bad, I can watch it, I'm the best, that ass girl.